wait, wait, wait. Imagine, imagine, say, what about you? And then she says, oh, yeah, actually. And then pull out a, a list super quick, but and it's then she's, not you. And then she's like, and then she goes into her notes, but you yeah. see her doing. She's, and then she's like, there, she's like, wait a minute. <laughs> and then stops. Uh, oh, oh. And then stops and like, oh, no. No, no, no. Oh, but your friend's there. <laughs> oh, <laughs> That's crazy. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. We're back. Welcome back. It's your boy Sergio's Talks. It's your boy Matt. It's your boy Carl. And we are still in the studio. Les Remarqués. Big, big shout out to them. We're going to be switching studios soon because the renovations are almost done. Or are they done? Almost. Almost done. Perfect. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Five stars on Apple Podcasts, Spotify, and Amazon. So I kind of have like a mix of topics that I wanted to talk about today. I mean, we've kind of been like the advice giving relationship gurus, you know, as of late. And I think that's what people thoroughly enjoy. So um, I had some topics that I wanted to go over that we haven't touched on yet. Right. right. One of the ones I wanted to ask is, what do you guys think is the worst thing about being in a relationship? The worst thing. I have an answer in my head, but I'm about to get canceled for this. I'm not canceled. To... Get canceled. <laughs> yeah, get canceled. No, I'll, be, I'll get canceled with you. I'll, I'll you you say what you want to say, and I'll say like I agree. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, because it, it's only beautiful things to be in a relationship. But I'll say the bad thing is, is well, you don't have options anymore. I don't agree. With that. <laughs> what do you mean you don't have options anymore? Because you can't go see yeah, somewhere. Else. Okay, yeah. Elsewhere. Okay, I thought like, like you're at, you're canceled as if you don't um, have. I just got to make a statement to the camera, uh, to my to my wifey. I I don't agree with that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm super happy with just one option. <laughs> no, but that's not what I'm saying. I'm not saying like 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 you want to go for the other options. But right, you're just yeah. saying you don't have other options. Yeah. Right. Which I don't know if it's a bad thing or a good thing. Like if you go back to the streets, you gotta like restart the whole Option, roster. But at the same time, what's the worst thing about being single is because you don't have one person to you. Also true. So it's this pretty much the same. What I would say is that the worst thing about a relationship is it's more so when, when and I, we spoke about this a couple of times, but when it, people get comfortable, mm. too comfortable. That is what what I think the worst part of a relationship mm. is when the guy stops trying or the girl stops trying, and then it just becomes stagnant. A lot of the time, you know, people put on what they call like relationship weight. You know, either the guy starts putting on or the girl oh, starts yeah. putting on or both. Right. And this could have been people that were like going like super at the gym, like 24 seven. All of a sudden, like they're comfortable. They found like their forever partner. And now they, they just stop trying and they stop performing for themselves. Mm -hmm. So that would I would suggest is what is the worst thing about a relationship. I agree. Shit. Worst thing about a relationship. Probably like disagreeing on the, where to eat. Let, let's, say, let's say you fight about it. I hate that. I personally hate that. Wait, but actually, that's a good. That's a good like segue to a new se to a. I had to thing. be him for, I know, to say that. No, I know, but, but at least this point, <laughs> yeah, at least, at least, at least this time around, it's valuable. <laughs> my question with that is, wow, that that's was crazy. Smooth, though, it was. That's I saw it coming though. Still, pause. Um, <laughs> yeah. Um, so, how do you guys handle when your when your boo thing is you know like moody because she's hungry? How do you guys? You know, figure out the situation because obviously you don't know where she wants to eat, mm. right? So how do you guys go about maneuvering, um, picking somewhere to eat? Because you can't ask her because she's gonna say whatever. Just pick something. Usually, actually, I just get food for myself, and she picks up my food. So whatever I'll get, she's, she's gonna, gonna pick up my food anyways. That's so I'll just, bad. I'll just be like, I'm so hungry. I wanted three burgers. Okay, but what, like, what if, for example, like the the, the plan was to go out and eat? If the plan was that, yeah, you said like, where do you want to go to eat? And she's like. Mm. Yep. I mean, but she's moody. And I mean, like, I don't know. Just pick something. I mean, you for me, you know, you know how I am. I'm very decisive. I'm not gonna give a fuck. I'll be like, we're eating there, mm. regardless. Mm. Even if she says no, I'm, I'm like, we're eating there mm. because I know when she'll have the first bite. She'll be like, oh, I'm actually happy to be here. I was like, yeah, I know. It's just had to eat. Yeah, she just had to eat. Mm. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not wasting time. Where you want to go? Where you want to go? No, I'm like, get in the car. Mm. Simple. Get dressed. I usually know where I want to go when I where I want to go eat too. Yeah, but it's not about like, you. It's yeah, about I her. know, I know. But like whatever I eat. Like, okay, but let's say you say you let's say you in your mind you're like I want pizza. And she's like, eh. she's like, uh, I don't want pizza. Yeah, she's like, don't pick something else. No, we're still going there. Think about it, because there's wings. 
there's there's everything in there's everything there's, there's fries, everything. There's fries. Wings, burgers yeah but sometimes there's, but sometimes they're like in a specific mood and you, like to, a and you have to and you have to go figure through it all out. the options let's say she wants sushi you know what yeah, i'm saying yeah no that's not different yeah and there's no sushi in a pizza place i always have like a safe bet Like, there's always like a safe bet of where you could say like where we're going you know sushi is always a safe bet yeah that's at least yeah. in my situation yeah. i feel like everyone likes sushis it's always like let's go out for sushi and like they're not very like decided yet they're like ah you know i don't know it's like let's just go to the restaurant sit down and we'll see what's there and then all of a sudden now she wants wants sushi. sushi was the best idea ever if not active listening of what she likes. You know what she likes, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, but sometimes what point. they like is not what they want in that moment. Mm, yeah, especially yeah. women. Sometimes bro. like it's pasta on Monday. Yeah. But then next week it's not pasta on Monday. It's mm-hmm. fucking salad. Also, if, if it was salad, I would break up with her. <laughs> <laughs> you can't do anything about it. So, sometimes she'll be so moody until you say Mandy's to get salad. She actually eats Mandy's. That is crazy. There's nothing you can do about it. You just have to go pay thirty dollars for a salad. Uh, but actually, but if she says that's crazy. But yeah. actually, if my girl says, if she actually like knows what she wants to eat, and she's like, I want Mandy's. I'm not even gonna ask any questions. I'm like, okay, we're going to Mandy's. Yeah. Yeah. If she knows what she wants. You know another way to get her mad if you go to Mandy's. Why would you want to get her mad? Wait, if you because it can just happen. <laughs> Toxic. If you no no no, it's not like do it, but it's like don't do it. Right, as as you go to Mandy's. What are you saying? Right, <laughs> listen. You go to Mandy's, and you buy her food, and you get something else. Yeah, uh, yeah. That what is, the fuck? You think I'm gonna? I, what do you think I want? Rabbit food. <laughs> <laughs> well, but that's 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 the worst thing you I, can I, do. I, she'll I, be cheese, and she'll pick in your food. Take oh, away. I see what you mean. Yeah, but I I but too bad. <laughs> too bad. You wanted you wanted Mandy's. If she wants Mandy's, she'll get Mandy's. It's just like the food court. You'll get this. But you'll hear the. Stuff. Oh, you're not eating. Oh no! Oh, but I don't want it then. No, no, no! Eat, 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 eat! No, I want you to eat too. What are you eating? And you're like, I want to get pizza. Okay, I want pizza too. Oh no, you don't want to. What do you want to get? You said no to pizza earlier, but I want to get what you get. But no, actually, the only thing that would like, uh, how do you say that? Actually, bring a difference between both is if she's veg- 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 vegetarian. Yeah, Take your time. Vegetarian. Vegetarian. One more time. A vegetarian? Okay. Is that it? Yeah. Wait, that's another topic. Would you date a girl that's vegan? Yeah, 100%. Yeah. It, it, it gets a little bit complicated when it comes down to like food and stuff. Uh-huh. Like if she's vegan, but she's not like, you shouldn't be eating that, then I'm okay with that. Mm-hmm. But if she's like, you shouldn't be eating that or think Every about this or yeah. think about that. My answer is, well, it's like, I don't care, but more no than yes. Like, it's just, I like eating way too much. Like, like you guys know, you like eating too. Eating what, sorry? Why, you have to why, why would you say that, bro? Like, no, because you got to be clear. Specific? Yeah. Eating food. Yeah, but she's vegan, so you like to eat what? My food. I'm Wait, are about. you allowed to eat out your girl if she's vegan? Because, can she eat you out? Because she's eating Because she's vegan? It's your can meat. she put meat in her mouth? Can you, can you even fight with your girl? Oh, Why you not? guys can't have beef. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Damn. that was good. I I don't know. I feel like vegan is the answer. Then it's like I, it doesn't bother me as long as what she's saying. Like like if she doesn't like every time that I eat food, you're she's eating like, a yeah. steak and she's like, oh, "That's great. You're you're killing an eye." You know what I'm saying? Yeah. If, oh, no, I can't. I already don't. I I really don't eat that much of like like um anything that's animal related because of my mom. My mom is vegetarian, so she's not vegetarian. She'll eat like meat once in a, a fucking I, month. I feel so bad because the the last time me, you, and your dad were all eating a big ass tomahawk in front of her. Yeah, and she wasn't eating it, right? No. Where all this big ass meat, and she was like, yeah. "Yeah, I'm good. Like yeah. it looks good though, but I'm good." Yeah. So wow. yeah, but okay, I respect it. Yeah, yeah, yeah for sure. Obviously, yeah. yeah. There's nothing. Yeah. There's nothing yeah. wrong with it. So long as like you're not in my face about it. Like, listen, I'm gonna respect you. You mm-hmm. be vegan. Mm. Let me be whatever I am. Exactly. Mm. That's just more meat for me. Pause. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to Shot O'Clock. <laughs> Welcome. Yeah, welcome. Welcome to Shot O'Clock. To the first ever, the first official Shot O'Clock. Shot the game. rules of the games are simple. I'm going to ask you guys three different questions with three different difficulties. We're going to go from easiest to hardest. Your guys' buzzers are those toot toot toots. Oh, okay. Shit. First one, first one to blow in it. Pause. 
First one to blow in it gets a chance to answer. Gotcha. Got it? Oh, okay. If if at the end, at 30 seconds, none of you give an answer, you guys both drink. Oh. Okay. Damn. Okay. Okay. Got it? Okay, yes. gotcha. Okay, but uh, you can't, yo, no, no, okay, first of all, he can't be like that ready to shoot. You know what I'm saying? Keep it at a, at a reasonable distance. It's not distance. part of the rules. Keep it at a reasonable distance. He's not part just of the adding rules. the rules right Keep now? Keep it as a re at a reasonable distance. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. So, okay. question number one. When is my birthday? <laughs> Matt. Uh, May 6th. One point goes to Matt. Zero to Carl. <clears throat> so, this is going to be multiple choice. So, Wait. let me read out the last, the three choices, all right? Yeah. So... When did World War II end? In the year 1936, 1945, or 1951? 45. Correct. <laughs> 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 yeah, right. Matt. Mm. <coughs> Yo, what the fuck is this? <laughs> it's, it's special juice. Last and final question. This is level oh, three difficulty. Shit. Player two ready? Yeah. Player light skin ready? <laughs> All right. Name me a country starting with the letter Y. <laughs> Yemen. Oh! Wow! <laughs> wow. Ah! And ladies nice and gentlemen, you. that concludes our first ever shot o'clock. <laughs> Major pause. Oh, wait, wait. <laughs> you know what happened to me the other day? <laughs> I want to go know your guys' opinion because like this this is something that actually affected me. I dreamt the other day. That you what? Dreamt. Oh. Dream. My bad. I, I I dreamt the other day that my girl cheated on me. Okay. Wow. With who? It, 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 what doesn't matter. It does though. It does. But I I don't I don't Oh yeah, I do remember who it was. Th listen, we all know how fucked up dreams are. They don't even make yeah. sense. It was one of the actors from fucking Stranger Things. It was like this this the Anyways, I'm going to put a yeah. picture up so people understand the reference. Anyways, n not a guy that I was threatened by. But it was just that... Is it the, the guy with the curly hair? The brother? Oh, my God. It has to be him. No, he's the boyfriend of, like, the sister of one of the kids. You're talking about the brother. I'm 100% sure. Yes, he's the brother of one of the, the, one of the kids. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So that's you've again. seen him a lot on TikTok lately, right? Yeah. I've seen so him like together. there was that, and then like you know my girl's on a trip, so I was like, ah, uh, <laughs> you know. So I, I, the, the, the point of the dream is, is, is not important, but you know, like on top of that, I was like in and out of sleep. So like when I would wake up, I would be like in my bed, so it would feel real, and then I would go back into sleep, and then like the whole cheating thing would continue. So when I actually ended up waking up, I was like, yo. This bitch cheated on me. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys wake up some type of way after oh, yeah. you dream about your girl 100%. cheating you? 100%. Okay, so what is your guys' rule? Like, does your girlfriend have to apologize? <laughs> <laughs> like, in real life for the dream that you had? Because you're, you're, let's face it, you're waking up salty as fuck. <laughs> there's no, there's no going around you're, that. You're moody, 100%. Um, for me, I has to uh, on the way she's gonna answer. But do you tell her though? Yeah. Okay. Come on, I had a dream, blah, blah, blah. And if I, if I, I tell her what happened, and she's like, oh, yeah, I did that? She's teasing you about yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's She'll gaslighting the you. fuck out. She's like, wow, I bet it was good. Wow. Hey, in your gym, did you... Did you did, no, she's like, did what position? Doggy? Maybe he has do you, do you guys? <laughs> do you guys think... Do you guys think that your girl ever thought about another guy while she's sleeping with you? Yes. Ouch. What? I'm sure she does. I'm sure. No, that's hard. I don't think so. Your I'm your sure. yes came out so quick, bro. Because I'm like, there's for sure, for sure, like a, a, so. a quick. Imagine, imagine she like you just with all your past relationship. Yeah, there's that one girl you can't make her come for any kind of reason. You're young, whatever, and then you somehow one day she ended up being able to come. You don't know what happened through her mind at that moment. Maybe she was like thinking so hard about her ex at that moment. She's like, oh. and she's like, thank you. You made me feel so good. And then she calls you by the name of the other. <gasps> is that is that worth breaking up? Yes. Is it, if she while having you, sex, one hundred percent. Yeah. If no. it's not during sex, like let's say we're just having. It's not fun. only during sex; it's while she's coming. No, no, for sure. Oh, no, I'm done. I'm done. Done. Nah. done. Legs are shaky. And no, 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 no. Hell no. Done so. So that's breaking up. It done is. worthy. I mean, it's not really during harsh. sex. Now she's coming. I, How do you explain that? How, did, how is she going to explain uh, that? I don't know. 
it's never happened, so I don't know. And she's gonna be like, oh, I'm sorry, I, 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 I what? <laughs> you know? There's nothing to say about it. Anyways, uh, I'm good. Nigga said maybe. You? You think one of your girls at one point thought about? Think about a girl that's like fucked with you, but doesn't fucked all the way with you. Okay, well, no, with those, yeah, but no, the, like the one, like one of the girls that you, like you actually wiped up and you guys were actually oh, like okay. serious, like. Oh no, I don't think so. Me for sure. I have one in my head, a hundred percent. Yeah, me too. Damn. For sure, I wasn't always like you know either like the fittest or the fittest in my, in my, in my pro- bro like or oh my fault. I I wasn't always like the fittest or like the in my prime moments mm. in my past relationships, you know. So I wouldn't be surprised if it happened in, in the past. Okay, yeah. Should we start um, confessions? All right, I prepared um, some shit for you guys, which is the most fucked up. Is it chocolate favorite shit? The most fucked up um, Twitter stories. Okay. And you guys can laugh like you cannot laugh. I will just let you know. You guys ready? Okay. My lady wants me to give her a plumpkin. It's head while she takes a dump. Do I deserve this type of punish- pu- punishment for drunk te- texting an ex? A plumpkin. So I'm going to say it again so you can edit nicely, right? Yeah. My lady wants to give her a plumpkin head while she takes a dump. Do I deserve this punishment for drink texting an ex? Oh, yeah. 100%. Absolutely. So you're, you're drunk texting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I ex. drunk texted someone and my girl's like, yo, come eat me out while I take a shit. Yes. And I'm, after that, I'm forgiven? Yeah. Yeah. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? What? Hell nah. What? She's taking a shit. Yeah. And yeah. You have to eat, her, have to eat out. her out. She's like, huh? And you hear the <laughs> as you're. That is crazy, bro. And floop, floop, floop. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, I got me fucked up. But I'm forgiven. Yeah. And she's my wife. I'm- yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna be forgiven in another way. No, it's, no you know it's have. that, is... it's that, or she's, you're, you're, she's out. What the fuck? She's yeah. like, yo, eat me out right now. I gotta go take a fat ass. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, she's like, she's like, she's like, she's like, eat me out. I gotta go poop. Anyways, bro, girls do like little rabbit poops, bro. It's gonna be like just bloop, 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 and that, and that's it. <laughs> And they take, and they take, they all take like thirty five seconds long, and that's it. What you go it, eat there for thirty five seconds. What about if it's diarrhea? If it's like Taco Tuesday night, yeah, tough. He like said s- tough, <laughs> tough, tough. But yeah. any other given yeah, day, bro. for me to be for- forgiven, all I have to do is eat you out while you do a, while we do a blumpkin. A blumpkin, huh? blumpkin. S- remember less. that. Okay, that's next crazy. one. That's crazy. I'm dating this girl, and I see her as my wife. But the other day, I found out she had a four-man train ran on her when we first started going on. And one of them was my boys. <gasps> what should I do? Because I love this girl so much. Hell nah, bro. Four <laughs> guys. That's four dicks, bro. One time. To the street. Like, like that's you've literally been, no, no, no. both I, hands. I'm a, I'm a, wait, wait. Wait, wait. I'm going to put you in context. Like, you, you've been with her for like four years and you just learned that. No, that's mad. No, no, no. no. That, wait, Pause. You've been with her for four years. Four years. And before the four years, she did that. Yeah, yeah like, like, like right before. Two months before you guys started <gasps> dating. She wanted to experience. Experience, huh? <laughs> and that experience is what scared her into a relationship. <laughs> and now she's with you, the guy that wasn't invited. You, the one who like picked her up to like to console let's, her. Let's uh, she's, uh, like, she's with you, the guy that was not invited. Let, imagine, but your boy was. Huh. Yeah, imagine she tells you all... Oh, I wanted something rough for one last time. Now I'm good. I want to do one more thing before I settle down. Bro. Run a train. A ch- that's that's four not a train. train. One that's of a, them was That's your a boy. wagon. I don't know. That's some Think about shit. it. It's been four years. You're with your girl. You just learn after four years. Wait, first of all, it's fucked up that, that his boy didn't say anything to his boy. Or her. It. Before. No, but her is like whatever. It's like, oh, my past. But your boy, as soon as you started dating... How he didn't tell yeah. me. And like, and like, yeah. it's not like he needed, it's not like your boy needed to give the details. Your boy could have just been like, yeah, like, yo, just to let you know, like, I, I, I like, I, I fucked her. Yeah. You know? Mm. But think about it. Like, four years, you have your girl. And after four years, 
I'm like, yo, Serge. So yeah, I, I it fucked your your wife with yeah, me and my boys. Yeah, with with up, Jack though. and Tommy. Wow. What'd you crazy. say? With with Jack and Tommy. Yeah. That was very specific. <laughs> That's the first names I can remember. But imagine I say Serge. So but, me, but, Carl, Jack, and Tommy. Yo, I don't know her. because I, this is gonna go into uh, like the same topic, but like off on a tangent because you you guys know very well. We spoke about this last time we were having brunch too. Whenever you discover something new about your girl, that wound is fresh. You know, mm. it's not like you had time to like. Even if it, even if you've been dating your girl for three years, if she tells you something like recent, you're gonna think this happened like in the last like four months, right. mentally speaking, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Even though it happened time ago, you know? So if I were to find that out, I, I would probably be able to get over it. Oh, I know. I don't know. Because like if it was one of you guys and like I would see you guys on a daily. Daily? I heard. Daily? Oh, yeah. I don't know. I don't know, bro. I would probably have to take a break from seeing y'all no cap. Seeing her, bro. Yeah, seeing her. And her, what the her fuck? and you. Wait. Oh, it's because you, I would be cheese because, like, why didn't you fucking tell me? That's one. Bro, I'm going to be looking at you in the eyes and I'm just going to be thinking. Her imagine, nice, I, yeah, right? imagine you're like, yo, it was fucking crazy. We were her little pink pussy. It's good. You liked it, right? Yo, it's good. Her, and it, and it, yo, her arch with doggy? Bro. Yo, right? And then he's like, did she give you the Glock Glock? She's like, and, then, and then you're like, no. no she, what are you talking about? In four years, she never has. She said she doesn't give a head. Yeah, I'm breaking. <gasps> Yeah, I know. A thousand percent, oh, I'm breaking oh, up. Oh, oh. A thousand percent, I'm what breaking up. What are you about up. to say? Third goat. She's a third goat. Imagine. Yeah, I know. First, we're, I'm beefing. One. That is crazy. Two, I'm breaking up. Three, I'm moving to fucking Costa Rica, bro. That's crazy. Do you, do you nah. pull her hair while you fuck her? That's crazy. No, 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 no. Yeah, exactly. Did she? Do you do the thing that she told you she likes? And he gives her a crazy ass position, and you're like, what? The there's no way. There's no way. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm not. Um, <clears throat> okay, this one, this one is just try to, not to laugh. Yeah, it's, my girl kept telling me to not worry about her gay friend. I said to both of them, I wouldn't, I wouldn't worry as long as he gave me head to prove he's gay as a joke. But then he said, sure. Didn't want to lose my pride and honor as a man. So I said, bet. I don't know what to do now. <laughs> Yo, I know damn well there's some guys out there that they're getting ahead for sure. <laughs> You're like, I don't want to lose a bet. Hell no. That's fucked up. <laughs> Carl, Carl, Carl's going to wait until like the last second before he says, ah. Hey, that, that, yo, bro, bro, did you guys understand what the fuck happened? So basically, my guys... Nah. I Let's say I'm the guy. I yeah. agree to suck your dick. And I'm like, yeah, I bet. Just because of my pride? Yeah. And then I'm there. No, you say I bet as a joke. And then he said, oh, okay, fine, sure. Um, Tuesday at 8. And then I, you don't want to lose your pride and honor. And he texts you at 7. And he's like, yo, I'm You're around the corner. I'm coming. So now what do you do? No, me? <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> I mean, you I, can just tell him it's a, jo it's I don't a joke. Know. I'm definitely telling him, like, I believe you. No, I believe you. It's oh, fine, yeah, right? yeah. Yeah, first of all, I don't know why the guy said that. You could have been like, yo, send me like a, a fucking picture of you sucking another dick and then I'll believe you. Why did it have to be suck my dick? I get it. Yeah. You know? I wouldn't ask that I, though. Yeah. Pause. Oh, wait. Okay, he, that, he's mad sus then. Because like, if I think, I think like he I actually think the guy wanted to try it. Try oh. Because just be like, yo, At just show me a picture reference of a fucking... Of you just kissing another guy. Or whatever. Dead ass. Your last boyfriend. Well, anything, anything, you know? that proves it. But he's like, yo, no, suck, suck my, my dick. dick. Jinx. It's a little sus. That was it. I have um, another one, but that will be for next episode. That is very fucked up. Very good. Uh, up to the next topic. Uh, well, actually, it's it's more the same topic because again, we had a we had by the way, just for you guys, you guys obviously weren't there, but we had a brunch where we spoke about a whole lot of stuff, and this is podcast is inspired by that brunch. There was at least eight of us. It was fucking. Anyways, it was over a whole, seven. It was a. Okay. And it was all the boys, man. Yeah, all the, the boys. boys. Talk. Yeah. Uh, so, but go, so going back to, um, yeah. So discovering, you know, about your girl's past, because we obviously nailed it down to you're like, you know, I don't mind. I actually like knowing about my girl's past. Well, like, you know, I like knowing, 
right? And I, I said, I, I absolutely don't want to know because mm. right? it's in the past. You know, I understand it's a part of you. I could, I could, you know, learn everything else about your past. I don't need to know about those specific. specifics. Specific no? details. What about you? I don't want to know the details. Right. Actually. But do you want to know what, like, he knows, though? No, no, no. Well, if. Like, this is your wife. Keep my, in mind. Okay, my wife, I would like, you not want to know her now. complete details. Right. You know what I'm saying? But that's the thing. But I'm, I'm so curious, you know? Sometimes, like. So, what happened? You know, yeah. you know, this is now like, damn, that's crazy. But then, agree. you know. You get turned off. You're exactly like me. You're oh, yeah. like you're gaslighted. You're like, yeah, yeah, I yeah, gaslight as fuck. No. Until she gives you that one sentence. She's like, yes. Yeah, I did that shit. And you go, yeah. Oh my god, that's so yeah. nice. So actually, in your head, you're like, there's no way you're gonna be my wife. Yeah. yeah so we're gonna Good do ass. something real quick. We're gonna address this camera right here. Okay. Ladies, we're talking to y'all. Sometimes we will ask you questions because we're genuinely curious and we will add to the topic, right? Mm -hmm. We don't wanna know every single fucking detail. All we want to know is when and where. That's it. When and where. We don't know the position. We don't want to know the dick size, how, how great it was. was. We don't even want to know if you regret it. Even if it was bad, I don't I don't care. Nothing. Don't tell me. Nothing. But they like that. You guys like the they details. When you ask details. us, you want every single detail. detail. What color was your boxer? Oh, is that is that the boxer over there? Show me her Instagram. Yeah. You guys are psycho. See pictures. Actually... When they see pictures, I feel like that's when. Uh, like, oh yeah. You know, yeah. Well, that's what we are, that's what we address though. Yeah, it is. Go yeah. for it. What? Oh, when what? they see pictures? Yeah. No, when they ask for a picture. Oh, if if I would show the picture. Yeah. I would. But what happened if like you know, like you know this other girl? Let's say she she says, "I want to see your best fuck," and uh -huh. you know. The girl's like, no, that you can't do. That's no. a 15 trap. 15 out of 10. That's a That's trap. A trap. That's that you a trap. can't do. Like, she's bad as fuck. Yeah, yeah. If she says, who's your best fuck, you know damn well you're yes. saying you, you are. Yeah. There's no way I'm going to be like, oh, wait, there's that one girl. There she is. And you can't pause either. You can't be like, no, uh-uh, oh without God. hesitation. Wait, 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 wait. Imagine, imagine, say, what about you? And then she says, oh, yeah, actually. And then pull out a, a list super quick, but and it's then she's, not you. And then she's like, and then she goes into her notes, but yeah. you see her doing... She said, then she's like, there. she's like, wait a minute. <laughs> and then stops. Oh, oh, oh. And then stops and like, oh no. No, no, no. Oh, but your friend's there. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that's crazy. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Yeah, that's But crazy. is it it is where where's the limit if if when she asks you a question and, and you have to be if you're too specific. I've def be. I've definitely like dolled down my stories. Yeah. When I'm it not. came to like if ever she asked me like specifics, I would I would like downplay it. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? Yeah. You don't say everything for real, for real. No, it should be like, you know, you know, who was the last girl you said before me? Because that's obviously a question that they want to know, right? I'll just be like, oh, you know, it was just a girl that, you know, I was, I was seeing at I one had point. a fling, whatever. Yeah, yeah just, just whatever. It. And she'll be like, yeah. can I see her? And I'll be like, what? <laughs> what do you mean? She'll be like, can you show me a picture? And I'll be like, but why? She's like, oh, you know, I'm just curious. And then, yeah. you know, you show her the picture, right? And she goes, yeah, she's pretty. Why don't, why doesn't, work? no, and she says the word, the sentence. Why don't you go for her? Yeah, yeah but that's okay. every, any, every argument after that, it's going to be, it's oh, why be don't a... you go fuck so-and-so? Yeah. As soon as she has and a name, And it's like, bro. you see, this is why I don't, this is this why I don't, don't tell you. It's a whole setup that I ask. Or like, she's brunette, and then the last girl you fucked is blonde. And then she's like, so you like blonde girls, right? Oh, that's why you don't like me, because you like this other girl, the blonde girl, right? Wow. But when I ask you, it didn't bother you. Yeah, it didn't bother me. Just go fuck her. Maybe it's not going to bother her. Now you're in deep shit. It's a setup. Yeah. They Back to the camera right here. You guys like trapping us. You love that shit. You're going to gaslight and be like, oh, it doesn't bother me. The guy just want to know. I'm curious. And then an argument comes up and you we're fucked. No. That's crazy. I'm not even in a relationship and I have a headache. I'm just <laughs> But it's true though. It, it'd be like that sometimes. It is. That as bro. They find anything to fight. So a question for you guys. Um, how do you feel about um having sex with your girl during her period? Oh my Love God. it. Oh, hold on. Wait, 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 whoa. <laughs> wait, hold on. First off, that is one thing that I'll obviously only do with my girl. One. Okay. Right. Two. 
I, it doesn't it doesn't it doesn't bother me and and girls know they know like within the first few days it's don't touch me mm. right but then after that like you know three four days in it's it's the remainings right it's the, the last few days and to me it's not the kind of things that i that bother me you okay carl yo bro uh, period sex bro that shit uh, i'm good with blood i'm good with all of that you know get your arm cut i bet pss, whatever when it comes to period blood, bro, that shit fucks me up. There's no way I'm first of all get hard, and second of all, I'ma pass out. But I like it though because I'm somebody that likes my girl getting pleasure. Because I know at least this is what for some girls, right? They're horny or when they're on their mm. period. The fact that I know that in my mind and knowing that she wants it even more now, that is what excites me. The blood is is whatever, bro. I've done way more <laughs> dirtier shit in my life than have sex. On a girl's period. Can you? What do you mean by that? Pinpoint. What, what do you, you mean, mean by that? Say what? You said dirtier yeah. shit. Actually, that you... no, no, yeah. I didn't. Re- would you, would you, would you, would you just? I would like for you to be more specific about dirtier shit than having sex while plumpkin? she's on Oh, plumpkin. Because he said that he didn't mind. Hello. <laughs> yeah, hold on. I'll be right there. Keep, keep going. Answer the question. Go your turn. Period, bro. Uh, my my answer is is I don't like when it's heavy flow. I like it after when it's not heavy. What is the opposite? Light light flow. Yeah. Light flow. I'm telling you, I'm gonna pass out. It's light flow. I don't care. It's a okay, but what do you do when you fuck her and you fuck her like kind of too hard and she bleeds? What uh. happened? Never happened to me. Never happened to you. And she bleeds. Uh-uh. Bleeds, bro. Uh-uh. You stretch her out too much? Uh-uh. Oh, sorry. <laughs> what, what did I miss? Actually, well, how did did you ever take a girl's virginity? Yeah, I did. And how did you feel about that? Because there was blood. I didn't see it. I, okay, you have to... Oh, okay, you have to see it. You know what I'm saying? It. I didn't see it. If I have to see it... Okay, so I, you, you could have period sex. I could, but I, don't, I can't fuck in the dark regardless. You know what I'm saying? You're so, so complicated. Yeah, but you're not necessarily like you don't like when, yeah, you're, I, when you're having period sex. Like it's not like the blood isn't fucking flowing out. Oh, Usually, typically, it's like 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 at the end, or as soon as you pull out. Yeah, like if you yeah you pull out and just if not during you, you, ah! you can't <laughs> during you can't tell the difference. Ah! And then it, it, it's just like you know when you when you uh, when you when you dip ice cream in like chocolate. Yeah. And then my 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 dick comes out bloody mary. Yeah. yeah. Damn! It's honestly, it's 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 at least for me, it's never oh happened. Where I was like, God. Oh, it's like small like cutlet, but like never. Oh no, not me. Oh. I had very heavy flow. Oh yeah, heavy flow, my guy. My dick being bloody as fuck. At one point, right, I thought that you know that something had happened. I thought either, you know, she had got caught in the inside or she was on a period, but like she told me that she wasn't. But when I tell you that there was blood, there was so much blood, but it was me. My dick was slit. Yeah. But like, I, I there, there, there wasn't any pain though. It was just, but when I, like, I don't, like, I, I lost so much blood. Yeah. Oh, you said slit. Slit. <laughs> you know, like you have the, like the, the attachment, the extendo mm, yeah. that attaches. I don't have it. Because oh. I'm circumcised. I don't have it. This, the, the thing that holds for you, I don't have it. <sighs> not, have nothing not, not the, the, the hat. But the hat, when it comes down, there's yeah. the thing holding. There's the, the thing. The yes, thread. There's, there's none. Oh, you don't? No. Really? Yes. Well, that's why you will never have to bleed from your penis. <laughs> You okay, Carl? That is crazy. You want to call the doctor? Yo, blood, bro. <laughs> yeah, but it was me, though. Yeah. Anything blood-related down there, bro. It's like... Eh. That it's shit like, was gushing, though. Ah. Cat. Gushing? Gushing. It was gushing blood. It was really, really bad. Okay. What the fuck we... do you do? You put a Band-Aid? No. You, you just do? You have a little hat? Yeah, I have put a, it back? yeah that is the Band-Aid. You put your hat back. I do just... you have a hat? Yeah, you have a hat. Yeah, do yeah, right. Condoms or no condoms? Four. Uh, what do you mean? Apple four? picking, bro. What do you mean? <laughs> <four>? <laughs> 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 Fuck. 
But you're talking with your girl or just like random fucking girls? Both. With my girl? No, with random girls? Absolutely yes. Absolutely yes. To what? Absolutely yes, no condom <laughs> is what you mean. To condom. Oh. You gotta protect yourself all the time. So we're lying on the podcast now. <laughs> I could cut it out if you want I to. I can always just no. You don't. You don't. You don't fuck raw any any random girl. You know what I'm saying, right? Right. I, I just can't relate to both of you guys. <laughs> Why? You're exactly the same as him. But he's lying right now. So yeah. I'm not. <laughs> no, I, okay, raw. You don't do condoms. Okay. But at the same time, your body count is super low, so it yeah, comes back because I'm not. I'm not gonna fuck who random girls. Smart. Okay. You know what I'm saying. Same thing for you. Yeah. Exactly. No, okay, there was one. You would you f- fuck more random girls than me. I don't know your history like that, so I can't say. I didn't, did I? I, did. I don't think I did. Both of you guys have a low body count with randoms. With randoms, yeah. Yes. With randoms, bro. I think I have like. You're selective with who you sleep with, too, like me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Not 100%. him. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm very selective. <laughs> I just I, I put a condom he on. He wraps it up. I fucking put a condom. No fucking question asked. <clears throat> I bro I had beef with a girl for condoms. Two girls. You did, you did, you oh, did. should I explain the story? That's a crazy story, though. I can say it on podcast. The, the, the floor is yours. The table is. <clears throat> well, girl, um, girl, if you recognize yourself, just uh, just know uh, this story is very fucked up. It is what it is, though. I'm not mad, though. Shit happens, I guess. Uh, so yeah, I, I've known this girl for a couple years, whatever, whatever, never had anything with her. And that one time I decided to went to her place and she wanted to study whatever you want. She wanted me to help her study. Right. And just to put in context, I was actually, when someone tells me come over, but to study, I'm not, I'm not this type of guy, but like, I know I'm fucking, there's no, I'm, I went with my computer and my fucking books, bro. And I sat down to study. That's the saddest thing I ever heard. I don't care. Five minutes in, five minutes in, she says, oh, let's take a break. And I was like, five minutes study? What are you talking about? She's like, mm, can we take a break in my room? I was like, okay, obviously. It's about to go now, <laughs> obviously. So we go uh, we we go to her bed or whatever, and we start making out, blah, 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 blah. And then um, I'm like, do you have condoms? She's like, yeah, yeah, whatever. She has a box. I'm like, cool. She has a box. She has a box. Okay, well, we'll get to that. We'll get there, right? She's very, very sexually active. I didn't know she was... Yeah, hence why she has a whole fucking box. <laughs> was it 12? Back of 12? 24? 48? 36? Mm-hmm. 24, I believe. Was there like one left? Oh, I didn't check like that, but there was not many left, to be honest. Or maybe that, that box is empty. She's like, oh, let me just grab a... Another one. Another one. And <clears throat> she's she's an, she She was very, very sexually active. Nice. And she has been, she hasn't been in a relationship for years. She's just like fucking around, right? For sure. Whatever. Yeah, and she, we start making out and then I reach for the condom. And then as I put the condom in, she's like, oh, why do you want to use condom? And then I'm like. Because I'm not fucking stupid. Yeah, but I'm not saying that. I'm like, because we're using condom. I'm, I said, if you want to, if you don't want to use condom, sure, you'll get tested. I'll get tested. And then we'll have so- sex exclusively, right? Pause. I have to say that, that I wanted to eat her out. And she says, no. I said, okay, fine. Wait. And then I, wait, 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 wait. And then, and then I say, okay, so am I getting head? And she says, no, I don't want to suck your dick because I don't know where your dick went. And I'm like, you know what? Wait, wait, wait. And I'm like, you know what? Fair. And then after I, I go for the condom, right? I go for the condom, put the condom. And she's like, oh, why you want to wear a condom? And then I looked at her and I'm like, what the fuck doesn't i don't say anything i'm just like you don't want to suck my dick because you don't know where my dick went so why should we fuck without a condom and she's like oh whatever okay whatever put the condom in and in this we're missionary position i give like two strokes she like push me like gently push me takes my dick take the condom off and then pulls me in without my consent or whatsoever and let alone, I didn't get in. I didn't even touch her. I just pushed her. And I'm like, yo, what are you doing? They started having a boxing match. <laughs> no, that us. I'm like, yo, 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 what are you doing? That's that's crazy. That's fucked up. And she's like, oh, I don't like condoms. It hurts me, blah, blah, blah. And then I get back to the point that like, yo, listen, get tested. I'll get tested. And then we'll just fuck just me and you. Nothing else. And then whatever, move on. 
I'm like, we're not having sex. Get dressed, whatever, whatever, whatever. She, she stays naked. And then she's mad at me. Oh, that's my fault. You're fucked up if you're seeing this. But I'm not mad now. It's been years. It never happened to you, uh, like, me, like, meeting a girl or, like, whatever, and you start talking to her, you're dating her, and then she just tells you, like, oh, yeah, I want to fuck, but no condom. Like, categoric, no condoms. I mean, I'm not the type to complain. And you can't say anything either. You're right, so it's not. Why, why would you guys, would you, that? no. I'm a <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. That's a catchphrase now. No, you got, it's just because you got to be, for, before anything, let's say I'm going to have sex with a girl, I'm going to check for a background regardless, you know. First of all, I get tested. Yeah. One. Mm-hmm. Even if, if I, she doesn't get tested? Who? The girl. Yes, but the girls that I sleep with, I, I, I see them for a little bit yeah it doesn't have to be exclusive and i gauge given how they are and how they speak about themselves and blah blah blah. you get to know them enough to then when i sleep with them i'm like okay yeah if it, but even after i sleep with them i'll still get tested for my own concern anyways. oh for sure yeah for but sure but it's, it's also like when you when you get to know the person whatever before there's chit chats about sex there's chit chats about oh last time oh when was the last when was the last time oh i'm inactive all that shit blah blah you get to like have a picture of how she is you know well, what actually, she likes and everything in bed. But that's a good question, better. though. Um, and we'll we'll finish up on that. Would you guys or do you guys or have you guys dated multiple women at once? When I was like 14, yes. What do you mean by... Never again after that? No. Really? N- never. What do you mean by dating? <laughs> what do you mean by that? Like, what do you mean by that? Like... Like a lot of girlfriends, like like no no like or not, no not multiple girls. relationships like like oh. dating multiple girls. Okay then yeah older All right. Uh, I think last time was I uh, sixteen or seventeen. But like you're talking going on dates. Wait wait how far are we in the the thing? Not not far. Like you're, you're like you're just dating. Like you've gone on multiple oh, well, dates yes, with multiple at women. Every age, every time I was single, I was dating multiple girls, multiple girls at the same time. If we're not exclusive, but have you ever like ex- like ex- not exclusive to the extent where your boyfriend and girlfriend, but were you ever like exclusively dating someone? Yeah, and multiple. Oh, uh, exclusive dating what multiple? No, yeah, never. like saying like like you know, never. like saying I'm with like I'm exclusive with you, 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 and you. Kinda no. okay. No. No. I, I always said, like, what applies to me applies to you. Mm-hmm. I, if we don't have the conversation about it being exclusive, then yeah, what's the matter, right? Yeah. So, but like you just said, it's also like chit-chats. Like, you have to chit-chat with the person. And yeah. at some point, that you talk to that person, and the person's like, oh, I'm exclusive with you. And you're like, oh, well, I didn't know that. I, I went on a date maybe last week or whatever. But since you're, you're being honest with me, then yeah, yeah. we're going to be exclusive from now on. Yeah. But definitely, when I was like 14, I had like three girlfriends at the same time. Okay, but that's great. Wow. They all knew, by the way, like, uh, knew it wasn't like it's accepted. Are you okay? No, bro. But like, I assume at 14 was the biggest fuckboy ever. Yeah, bro. okay, I get so. I oh, get but like, that. they all knew that, like, I was talking to this girl at the same time and yeah, talking, like, and then I was in a relationship with her for, for three weeks, and then a relationship with her for two yeah, weeks, no, and then you, you that's get mad. Point. Okay. I haven't done that. I've, I've, are you okay? Yeah, I was thinking about how I was gonna phrase it. I've dated, I've dated multiple girls at the same time. Yeah, but like as in like going on dates. No, yeah. yeah, like the yeah. minute that I start honing in on just like one, mm-hmm. then I stop. Yeah, yeah, for sure. If that makes sense. Yeah, I got you. When I start wanting to be more, going on to the more exclusive route with one person, mm-hmm. then I'm I'm no longer dating multiple women. Okay, but do you guys think you need to have a conversation with the person to be exclusive? A thousand percent. Yeah. Or. After a while, after like four or five months of also, talking, whatever, also. you guys like, oh, we should, we're, I'm, I'm guessing we're exclusive. You know what I'm saying? No, because you can't assume. You can't assume. Okay, so you can never assume you can never until assume. you have that, that you talk. You have to have the conversation. Okay, good. I, I agree with it. Like, it's, I think both, just me personally, how I am, mm-hmm. if I start seeing you, as long as more than like three or four dates, I start being naturally exclusive to you. Yeah. Just that ass. But if I go on one date, obviously not. It doesn't make sense for no, both for sure. of us. Maybe she she went on a date last week. Like, this is part of the dating world. You going on multiple dates yeah. for months and then until you see your person. The only thing, like, when, when we're talking about it now, it could seem I'm dating multiple girls at the same. It sounds so fucking bad because for some people, dating is like being in a relationship. It's yeah. actually just going on dates. Yeah. Right? yeah. Um, but it's just to not hide shit. I think that's where it comes, like, it's the gray zone to, like, don't hide it. 
uh, but also like be honest about it. You know, you don't have to say like, oh, I went on fucking six dates and you're my seventh. That's just being shady for no reason. Yeah, but there's some people that rather not know though. There's oh, some people, for sure. But but for like for me, for example, like if I like first off, I'm not sleeping with all these women. One, mm. the minute I start sleeping with one, that's when I start putting the other ones on hold. Um, you yeah, know what I mean? Yeah. So I'm not gonna be. Like sleep. entertaining five girls and going out with five girls and fucking five girls. Right. Mm-hmm. Already for me, I need to have like a mental and emotional connection to the person too. Yeah. So like if I'm like and dating multiple people and sleeping with multiple people, that means I'm I'm going around my business the wrong way. Mm-hmm. Right. So the minute that I start sleeping with someone, then that's when I know that okay, this is the person I'm actually be attributing more time to. Because then again, like when when the dating becomes a little bit more serious, I don't want to be going on a date with her and then feeling bad that I slept with someone else, like, you know, like like two three days ago mm. you know what i mean i don't feel like I, i'm being right because you know although maybe she's doing the same thing too that's her business but i'd rather not take the chance and ruin something good yeah by you know just sleeping around rather than just you know dedicating myself to one person now and if it doesn't work with her then you know like the other ones won't be like too far away mm. I, you get, know? I get what you mean until you have that talk until you have that talk of being like i'm exclusive like, are we exclusive or not yeah. kind of thing and then there's no hold for no one. It's just everyone, bye, bye, yeah, bye, bye. Yeah. Mm. And you have one, your one boo thing. You drop your prospects. Prospects. I didn't your say roster. That. I mean roster. Pro- pro- prospect is more fucked up than roster. It is. Yeah, roster is like a list. Prospect is like you have a book. No, no. prospect. That's not what it means. Prospect so. is 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 it's girls like, that you will like. Or like you have, let's say you're, you're dating. NBA draft. Okay, no, no. Let's you know say our prospects like this guy is fucking nice. Okay, he's about yeah. to get drafted. Okay, I oh, and then you have a list that you already have your team. Okay, so you have LeBron, Anthony Davis, and Russell Westbrook on the team, and you have your prospect that's not even in the NBA yet, but it's nice though. He's doing highlights in high school. That's not how I see it. I see prospects as I being like it. no, what? prospect is is basically like uh, let's say you're having multiple dates. You're dating like not. I mean, you're going on a date with a girl, you know what I'm saying? She's great. And then the, two days after, you have another date with another girl, and she's great also. So that makes two prospects, you know what I'm saying? Just like for them, if they're going out with that one guy, and he's great, and this guy is great too, she has two prospects. Combine. And be a combine. Got you. You know? And whoever is the best a, is going to be who's going to be exclusive afterwards. He's going to draft it once. I get it. I had a different definition in my mind. That's to me, cool. it was like the reverse. Oh, no. Yeah. Like roster is like shorter, and prospects is like... I don't know. Prospects, like, to me, is like, you know, you see, like, a kid, like, playing on the basketball, and you're like, oh, he could be a potential prospect. Exactly. Know? So it's not a so, problem yet, but you already have a list. Yeah, but rosters, like, there's, you already have, like, the selected few, you know, on the roster. So you imagine you have a championship team. Anyways. <laughs> that, <laughs> that's how we're going to wrap up today's episode. 2019 was great. Um, what? what? I'm just kidding. Don't forget just... to like, comment, and subscribe. Give us five stars on every platform, <laughs> including Amazon. <laughs> yeah. It's been your boy Sergio's Talks. It's been your boy Sergio's Talks. My God. And we'll see you guys next week. Oh,